Welcome to the Bayesian vlog. This is my first time ever in Barbados and it has just happened in the most random, spontaneous, adventurous trip ever because we are now here in Barbados and we've been here for actually a day, actually a day and a half. We got here, not last night, but the night before. And yesterday we just took some time to just chill, relax, get to know the area. We're staying in this gorgeous Airbnb, guys. I found this Airbnb last minute like i'm talking searching the internet like where are we gonna stay and then i came across this and it's one of those like rare finds it basically means that the hosts here are super hosts and it's usually booked up but we managed to get it today is friday and we got here on wednesday evening wednesday evening our uh, airbnb host lingerie who was so so sweet lingerie took us like for a drive around the area so that we could figure out what it was about and then we went to worthing square what's really odd about being in the caribbean is that you get a lot of uk names like literally everywhere things are just called the same names as they would be in the uk and i think we all know why swiftly moving on we went to worthing square and it's kind of somewhere where there's live music there's foods and everything woke up the next day and yesterday we had like a like a chill day Friday night seemed to be the best night to be in the Caribbean because obviously we landed in St. Lucia last week on a Friday and we went to the Grossi Lay street party and that was amazing. If you haven't watched the St. Lucia vlog, please go and watch it. famous Bayesian so yeah shout out to Rihanna shout out to Barbados and here we go I'm wearing the same exact thing that I wore in in fact all my outfits are gonna be exactly the same as St. Lucia because this was not planned for but life have been lived cheers this is the exit of our little Airbnb it's so cute and oh my goodness guys yesterday there was a monkey that came right there like literally I thought it was a cat and I was like oh babe look it's a cat oh no it's not a cat and it came all the way here I've just been looking out for it all this time. It is so, so hot. Like every so often I just keep popping my wig off and just doing me. <laughs> but um, there's a nice breeze to this place. Another thing that I liked about where we're staying is that it's really quiet at night, like literally. When you're walking around Barbados, all you can hear at night is like chickens, dogs barking, and in fact, loads and loads of dogs barking, but just down this way here, it's really, really nice and quiet. One thing, guys, I want to say is when you're walking down here, you have to be careful because the cars, the way they drive in Barbados is different. Whew. They be driving at them speeds. I'm just like, where are you going? You are in the Caribbean. Where are you going that's so fast? And there's a lot of people too. Look at this. I love the colors of the house. It's so colorful and beautiful. I've got Daphne shorts on my shoulders because it is hot. Oh, 
Beijing rum. Beijing rum. It's the coolest down on our walk. Grapefruit juice. Tiny bit of pineapple juice. Really, ideally, you want the white rum and the grapefruit juice, but the grapefruit juice wasn't 100%, so. <laughs> Hi, guys. I did not expect this. I don't know what I expected. It's dark inside. Damn. Okay, Bubbles, I'm gonna, I'm gonna try it out. It's as sports bars as it comes. Surround sport, dark, cool. The portions here are crazy. Like, how is this one person's breakfast? I'm glad we got one. Yeah, I'm glad we got one too. This is after we split the breakfast. This is like the UK size portions, but we have ordered some extra bacon. They said two pieces. <laughs> so this is where we came yesterday we actually had lunch here at this pizza spot but i'd give it mm, average and then there's also a supermarket so i'm gonna go in here and get some snacks it is so 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 hot we're actually just gonna go and chill back in the house and then come back when the sun's come down it's crazy hot let's see the supermarket <laughs> I love looking at these and seeing what I'm gonna get. But nothing is screaming to me. What would you get? Oh, hot and spicy. I like spicy and maybe not tortillas. Good evening, guys. Good evening. Time is 9.30 p.m. and we are on our way to Oysters Fish Fry. And it's apparently the thing that you have to do on a Friday night in Barbados. <laughs> and so I'm so excited because we're heading there. We did nothing today, guys. We napped. That sun, it beat us down. Ooh, my baby's got a taxi. That's exactly what we wanted. Perfect, guys. This is where the fish is at. So we are en route to um, the fish fry. And apparently it's the thing that you have to do in Barbados. And we're really you want, excited you want you for it. No? You want me when there's a roll No? No, 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 we're good, we're good, we're good. We're just gonna do a quick stop to pick up the taxi guys, go. Because he said he's gonna pick her up. I said, yeah, if you tell your girl you go pick her up, you go pick her up. So we go in together. Me and you, we go together now. This is where we ate yesterday. The square is quiet today. It's because everyone's at the fish fry. Oh yeah, because yeah, everyone is probably at the fish fry. She ready on though? She's really picking up this girl. I rate it, babe. Yeah, I was thinking. <laughs> <laughs> it's so funny. What? But she's going ready. She's got to be ready. Right, she's going to be ready. Yeah, for you, ready here. I don't think she's going to be ready. You think she's going to be ready when yeah. we get there? Yeah, wait for her to make sure. Yeah. She's ready. She's ready. She's, ready. she's, she's ready. saying that, but she's probably just doing her eyebrows right now. <laughs> We've stopped by here to pick up his girl, who he said was going to be ready. I knew she was not going to be ready. Why would she be ready? If someone calls you, says five minutes, that's when you're in the shower. <laughs> That's when you jump in the shower, no girls? Yes? So we're gonna stop and wait and then we're gonna get to Oysters Fish Fry hopefully today at some point. Guys, it is triple confirmed. Beijing drivers drive crazy. Our taxi driver was on one fighting, man. fighting people was in the, the car lighting. shouting your mother <laughs> suck your mother suck your mother ah! and then the woman pulling up at the petite, uh, petrol station he's literally running up behind that woman i was like are you seeing the woman walking but anyway we're here we're outside whatever he gave us his number so we can get him on our way back yeah, right. uh, nobody's hitting him up again are you all yeah, right. But here we are. Let me show you where we are. I can see all these different stands. Rosalind's, another one here. And there's just a vibe. People sitting, chilling, eating. There's even a barber's here, babe. Look at that. Right there. I don't know. Somewhere ahead here. <laughs> you can do a lot. You can eat here. You can chill. You can get your hair cut. Yeah, let's stay back. And then this is the roadside, guys. This is this place is crazy. But should we get to the petrol station and get some yak? Pulling up at Tiger Mart for some cash. ATM. We need more cash for our fish night. They got hot Cheetos. <laughs> oh my god, that looks so good. That looks so good. Whatever he was eating looks so good. Where are the stores at, babe? Let's go that way.
had to order some food like Debbie Fry and Grill. I can't decide whether I want a dolphin or whether I want. You, oh, you have. What did you order? You wanted a dolphin. Right? No. You wanted shrimp. I wanted. I wasn't sure if I wanted shrimp, but it's fine. I think I ordered it. I don't even know if the woman took it down. Have we ordered? Who knows? A young boy to go with it. Suddenly it's raining. Like really, really pouring. And it's gone crazy. Look at the rain behind me. Tins fish frying and it was a good time. It was a really good time. It was real chill. It was very, very like relaxed. There's two different vibes. There's like the older side where there's like the dancing and the salsa and the older crowd. And then there's like the other side where it's the like, vibes and it's chill and it's more like music. Yeah, I liked it. And the food was good too. Definitely got red snapper and I got some prawns. Though I kind of low-key regret getting the prawns. I kind of wish that I got the something else like the mahi which is the dolphin and our journey back we were trying to finalize what to do tomorrow or rather we finalized our plans but we just didn't know how we we're going to get there we we're going to try and go and see the horses in the morning and we arrange for our taxi driver to come pick us up at 4 30 and the time now is nearly midnight so we have like four hours running low on sleep good morning guys good morning i'm so excited i can't believe we actually woke up on time i don't know whether to spray myself with mozzie with mozzie spray or sunscreen or because it's either one or you're gonna need one either one or the other let's go up to the beach beach straight away good morning Hi. I feel like Damini and I are like the luckiest people ever. So we've come to the beach and it's really early in the morning. It's literally not even five o'clock. And our taxi driver has just decided to wait for us instead. He said he's gonna go sit in the, na in the car and take a nap and just wait until the horses come and go. And he's not charging us any extra for it. Like we literally come across the nicest people on holiday. Always, always, always. But I think it's because our vibe, our vibe is a good vibe. And then everyone matches the good vibe, you know? So we just come to the beach right now. There's not a single soul here. We saw one horse on our way up um, with its owner, but apparently they come here and they just start um, washing and running up and down, which I think would be majestic. For now, my boo and I are just gonna sit and chill by the beach and listen to the oceans, ocean crashing and the waves. The internet said that you should come around 6.30. Our Airbnb host said you should come around six and our taxi driver brought us around five. So, I've got this on, but it's not really that necessary at all. It's a nice cool breeze, it's not even cold. Both of them come. Good morning. You bring them here in the, every morning? Yeah. Can I touch them? Yeah, perfect. No. <laughs> the boss, the horse tried to eat this bit and I was like oh it's so cute and then I realized it's biting at my chest please but um, he says he's got two more horses that he's gonna bring back down and as you can see it's getting lighter outside blue here hour. it's blue hour now this is a really good time to, to take photos and also we get to see the sun rising as well in the next like 20 minutes or so but there's at least two more horses coming down so I'm so 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 happy like who doesn't like being on a beach even horses love being on a beach. I'll link the address where you guys can come. We are currently at Pebbles Beach, but I'll link it below for you guys to check it out. And it's like a six minute drive from our Airbnb. So it's actually perfect. Like I said, guys, where I found, it was low key as steel. Look at this. What a way to start the morning. Very nice. That sun is ridiculous. Look at that. That's crazy. 
Good morning from Barbados, indeed. So good and brown. <laughs> I was you're too scared. I was too scared. Because I, I was scared of him kicking me. No, she can kick me. She can't kick me. Yeah. You don't go swim, you don't go kick, you don't go do nothing. Yeah. All you have to do is hold him in. Main, yeah, and she can do that's everything. Yeah, right, hold, just relax. Hold she in, hold she eight. I just steer she. Oh, what well, happened? Well, then maybe I might go again. <laughs> I might go again. Yeah, I'll do that. Yeah, please. Because I didn't want her to kick me and I didn't want her to be scared. She do not kick. Most things she do, she yeah. loves to, love to play. She has to play. She has to love to nibble. They kiss it. Enough kisses, you know? <laughs> oh, it's really nice. That was quite literally phenomenal. I cannot believe how lucky we have got this morning. That is an experience that literally, I don't even know how much money somebody paid for it, but we got it for free and it was so amazing. I got just filmed with the horses all the way inside, into like all the way to where the boats are. I did not expect that when we woke up at 4.30 this morning, but I'm so excited that that happened. If you are in Barbados, you have to try and come. And when the horses get here, just get talking to the guys. Get, friendly I always say it just be friendly say hi say what's up and eventually they were literally like do you want to just take the horse and like swim the horse I was like me <laughs> what do I know about swimming horses but then we got to do it and it was amazing and the day hasn't even barely begun yet so I'm so excited 12 out of 10 experience Barbados you get a win from me and our taxi driver is still waiting for us which is insane sensational we're gonna go probably for breakfast or probably go and catch a nap and then carry on with the rest of our day. Babe, out of 10? 12. 12. Out of 10, Damini gives it a 12. Out of 10, I give it a 30. Literally, 30 out of 10. And 12? <laughs> <laughs> always carrying my bag. Bless him. Thanks for always carrying my bag, babe. any given opportunity. Have you guys been drinking rum punch? What have you guys been drinking? We're gonna get a rum punch. Yeah. Is that what you have? That's absolutely what you need to have. Okay. <laughs> it is. It's been our drink of choice. 
he put it on top? What did he sprinkle in? Nutmeg. Nutmeg. Oh, really? Okay. Yeah. I'm going to have one of those. Very nice. It's alcoholic though. Huh? It's alcoholic. Oh, oh, okay. Oh, okay. 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 And shipwreck tour. I booked this on TripAdvisor again. <laughs> I'd just be looking for stuff online and just be like, okay, cool, what's there to do? And actually, thank you to everybody as well who, when I asked on Instagram, sent like a whole bunch of stuff for us to go and try and do. I really, really want to see turtles. Like, I really, really want to see them. When Damini came last time, you came for like three days and yeah, you saw them. You tried to see them every single day and you saw, and them, you saw the, them on the last day. Just on the last day. So I'm hoping that today's our lucky day. We just get in there and we see the turtles straight away. The cloudy sky is really giving a lot of cloud. I hope we don't get shipwrecked. We're gonna go over to the ship right first and then the turtle stop after. So they are mandatory. If you guys are great swimmers, you can always let all the air out, but you must keep the jacket on, okay? Okay. You guys can start gearing up now, so if you stop, you can maximize our time in the water, yeah? They fell in love with the island, the girls, and the rock. We saw whales in Saint Lucia. You guys, you guys put whales here? Uh, yeah, but piranhas. <laughs> Last normal year. Good evening, guys. Good evening. What on earth is going on? <laughs> I think I popped my shoulder when we were swimming with the turtles earlier. It was so much fun, literally, it was so much fun. And then I wanted to like dive into the water, but I think I pushed too hard on the force of the water as I was diving in. And literally my, my shoulders, I'm very flexible naturally, and my shoulders pop in and out anyway. But when I pushed into the force of the water, my shoulder literally popped out. It was so weird, it was so painful. So I'm just here chilling in the room. My husband's gone to get some food. We're gonna have Shafet again so chauffeur is meant to be like the mcdonald's of the caribbean uh, according to lindry who's our airbnb host um but it's so good it's so much better than kfc i don't know if i said this before but it's honestly so much better than kfc the food is so flavored i've got like two mesh sundresses supporting my arm sling which i have just been watching on youtube lydia down <laughs> what's new lydia down delivery chauffeur hubby has got this back and he's also got me a ton of painkillers and some sweeties it's just so good Sweet. yeah chef it it's banging good afternoon guys i'm 
crying. Babe, there's two wigs hanging outside. This is something I would do. <laughs> On the net. I thought you meant two of yours. Oh, yeah. No, that's so funny. <laughs> that's the best place to hang your wig to dry it. Literally, this wind is perfect for it. We're actually leaving Barbados today. Our flight is at like 10.30 this afternoon, this evening. Well, I'll take it easy. Gonna take it easy and then we're gonna catch our flight back home and end our super long adventure, which was meant to be a two day adventure that turned into two countries. <laughs> I love it, like literally life is for living. And so we live, even with your arm in a sling. I think it looks cute. Look at the colors. It was a good shout. He said it was good, right? Alright, we can check that out after. Walking around and I'm seeing some of the trees have like the metal around them. What does that mean? I'm sure you guys know, but what does that mean? Those three have them as well. What's up with that? There's always a paid actor that's a bird. Literally every time I love it. It looks so good. Stuff. Hmm? Really good stuff. If you're one arm. It's the food for me. I'm a little baby T Rex. Hey, I'm not a T Rex. Don't call so, me T Rex. I mean, <laughs> you little claw. <laughs> Very nice. It was definitely a monkey, babe. Looked pretty good. I hope you enjoyed your trip to Barbados with us. If you like this video, I have plenty more on my channel for you to check out. I'm also trying to reach 300,000 subscribers, so please be sure to subscribe, like, and share the video with a friend. And I shall see you on our next adventures.